Alright, hey guys, welcome back. I'm very excited to record this video. So let me just start off with that. So super excited guys, I will share with you a win to loss to win again story. Okay, of one of our channels, Stoic Being. Now again, if you are an active follower of my channel, then you already know what I'm talking about from my yesterday's video. But today we are back at the game, guys. Let's go. So, um, this video title is going to be building a $1,500 a month YouTube automation channel and just watch me, right? Watch me do it. So the structure is simple, guys. Like I will tell you a quick story what happened. Um, so in we, we started a YouTube automation channel in February of this year, 2024, right? In on February, we started the channel and the way I started the channel was using AI mostly, right? It was in stoicism niche and we posted videos with um, script writing and voiceover was through AI, right? We just re um, paraphrased scripts from other videos. AI was using, AI was the voiceover. We used Play.HT software. And then for video editing and thumbnail, I had my best editor who was editing for my channel and he has been working with me for a very long time. So we are like very good friends. So what I did was, okay, so look, um, so it, his name is Josefa. So he and I basically talked and I was like, okay, look, we can start a channel. It's going to be great. Um, how about we have 50, 50 stake on the channel. So I do not even have to incur cost. Um, I can do these things. You will do the editing and let's go. Let's get this channel up and running. And that's how we did. We started in February. Okay. A lot of effort went into it. We posted more than a hundred videos, close to 105 videos or something now. Um, and after five months of persistence, we were able to hit monetization threshold, which is 1000 subscribers, 4,000 hours of watch time. And I know five months is a bit of a long time. And it's because in between somewhere I was, I lost conviction that this channel is not going to perform. There just does not seem to be high demand. But somehow, because I had me and my support rep, Mukhtar, we had created enough scripts and voiceovers for the videos. Our editor, Josefa, I did not knew this for two weeks or so. I just thought we stopped this channel and he was continuously posting videos every single day, right? So at the end of the day, it's all about volume, guys. Again, it goes back to the same lesson. Post more first, right? Before performance, before doing it right, you just got to post more. So he was posting without me knowing. And then two weeks after I was like, okay, let me get back at it. And I look at the channel and there's videos being posted. And some of the videos have performed like thousand views, thousand five hundred views. Okay, great. We see performance. You have been consistent. Super awesome job. I'm, I'm back at it again now. So two weeks after I returned and then we post more and then I found new ideas and then we started to get really good views, thousand views, 2000 views, 2500 views. And by getting those views and because we have been posting for so long, everything just elevated and we hit the monetization threshold. Now, after we hit 1000 subscribers, 4000 hours of watch time, um, our channel got hit with reused content strike, right? So what happened was yesterday, it just it was just yesterday, and I recorded this appeal video to YouTube saying, look, our videos are not reused, right? We are doing scripts, I'm like screen sharing, showing them the Discord chats. And I'm like basically showing YouTube, look, we, me and, okay, again, this is, this is after me submitting the appeal video to YouTube, right? I was like, okay, look, um, our channel was hit with this, as you can see, I took a screenshot. So it was reused content and it says content is clearly not an original creation of this channel and may have been repurposed from another source without adding original commentary and blah, blah, blah. So that was the thing, right? I lost my hope. I was like, okay, we are done. This is definitely not going to work out because I've seen many, many cases, guys. I've mean, seen many cases, 90% or more, like it just does not happen, right? You have lost it. So this happened and we were before that we were talking about hey we got this win big achievement like blah 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 we are going to hit the monetization threshold happy dance and then all of a sudden um we ap i apply for monetization and it gets reduced content strike and i'm like oh shit, we lost it man and then appeal i did an appeal video i said look youtube um we look you can look at the chats me and my team work together we have this trello board where we are doing all of this content it's all legit we are creating videos it's not taken from somewhere else it's not reused content and i make it super convincing video at least my editor my editor Josefa said that he was like yeah bro the video was quite convincing um so that happened and then i wake up today do my meditation and i get to work and i see okay great channel is monetized we are we are in the game now I literally did not even click anything yet. So literally channel is monetized guys. Let's go. Now, okay, before I go, in, go any further, 
um, I want to tell you this one thing. The lesson here is not to say that, hey, just make AI videos, you will get away. Absolutely not, right? I learned my lesson and maybe I already knew the lesson, but I, again, it just reinforced to me that okay, AI is not the way to go. You can maybe do AI voiceovers, but chat GPT scripts or whatever, chat GPT scripts is the only thing that you can completely automate, paraphrasing or writing with chat GPT. Um, AI voiceover you can. I've seen many big channels do it, but I don't know why my channel exactly got demonetized. I don't think it is the voiceover guys. I think it's the chat GPT um, because we paraphrased scripts. And the other thing I think was repetitive footages because we are in stoic, this one, right? Stoic niche. We are using same kind of footages, like just mixed up together in various videos. So I feel like that also YouTube is not looking at as real added value. There needs to be more footages, more different information than just the same few 50, 100 footages being repeated in every single video we post. So I feel like that also looks like reuse or repetitive content. So that, that seems to be the problem, but I'm telling you, I'm going to change things many, many, like really differently, right? I'm not going to do the same AI way that we used to do it, the scripts and all of these things. And that's what I will talk about here. So we know what ideas works, right? So we literally shifted this idea. I asked my editor, can we do these ideas? And he said, yes. And literally upon shifting in one single shift, I just knew this was going to happen. Right. And we just shifted and we just started to get 2000, 3000 views and instantly we hit the monetization threshold, right? It's all about ideas at the end of the day. If you're getting less than a thousand views, no, it's the idea it has nothing to do with video before 1000 views. Once you have 1000 views and you're only getting 1000 views, then it's about the video, right? You have shitty video or thumbnail or no thumbnail needs to be good. Only then you get thousand views. So thumbnail packaging is what matters. So we know what ideas work. Okay. Clearly we can continue on that direction. We are going to shift towards making videos more original. So what do I mean by that is finding a real script writer, right? Again, I don't know how I'm going to do that. Like, <laughs> I mean, like whether I'd be paying them on a per script basis or partnership basis, probably per script basis, voiceover will remain AI. We will see, like I've seen many big channels do this. So this will, this test will still continue. Video editing, I will work with my video editor and we will build a big library of thousand plus footages and literally thousands of footages of all of the footage that we use in our videos and just using more variations, adding more effects, background sound, no copyright, of course, and making the videos as original as possible. So we do not have to run into these issues and thumbnail doing what works and not crossing the line. So what do I mean by that is like right now, I just click, let's go. Okay. Um, I just clicked it and I need to connect my AdSense here, I believe. Yeah. So I'll do that. Um, if I go to the content, we are making videos around, I don't know, women and like how to behave and all of these things. So we do not want to cross too much line with like thumbnails and videos. We just want to stay within the boundaries of what YouTube considers as good content. So that is one thing. And lastly, we have ideas, rewriting titles. So this is also one thing that I need to do a bit differently. I saw ideas that I was like, okay, these are great ideas to model and everything. But then I got a bit lazy with even rewriting titles, right? I saw, I would see this idea that says, um, 10 stoic lessons to be happy in life. And I would be like 10 stoic, um, stoics, 10 lessons to be happy in life. Right? So that's, I did very little variations there, or I was like five stoic lessons to be happy in life. So I I'm thinking that I need to do more variations. Take the idea, of course, the viral idea and write it a bit different, differently and change up the wordings and everything. So in no way the channel looks like, yeah, it's just reused content, right? So rewriting titles more differently, not using the same words from model competitors, right? Not just completely writing the same thing. Then volume. This is the part, right, guys, this is the part we, we are going to change and it's going to hopefully elevate our views to 10, 50 K views. Right? Because we need to get more views, right? Monetization is not enough. You need to get consistent views to be making money. Then you have the volume. Um, I'm aiming to do one to two videos per day and I'm going to communicate that with the team um, and see like how we can write more scripts, edit more videos, post more. So if you know what works, the game ultimately just becomes doing more volume, right? Just do more volume, get more views. And now talking about the goal, the goal, as I already mentioned in the beginning of the video, it is $1,500 a month, right? So $1,500 a month would be 500,000 views, half a million views at $3 RPM or 300,000 views at $5 RPM, right? RPM is again, amount you to pay you per thousand views. So I should, I don't know what the RPM is going to be. That's why I have two of those variables there. It should be pretty good in my opinion. 
because we are getting um, viewership from US. So that's pretty awesome. So you can see like 40% of our viewership is from US. So that's a win right there. And pretty much the revenue should be determined because we just got monetized. Now the things will start to appear. Um, and again, if you guys don't believe me, I literally submitted an appeal video as you can see. So if you want to see what I said in that video, maybe comment below, join our community and I'll share that with you. I don't know. Or maybe I'll just share with my students inside the program. Join in, right? Link in description, schedule a call. So that's about it. Now also let me show you the chats here. So <laughs> it was very fun guys. So as you can see, literally uh, my team member Rusev have posted after six months of effort, time and energy, we finally hit the threshold. And we all like got super happy and let's freaking go. And all of a sudden, uh, today I dropped this message saying, hey, it's all, it's not all sign, sunshine and rainbows. Um, submitted an appeal, then got accepted. Uh, we lost hope, but it just somehow happened. And then it was the fun part, win to loss to win again. So I think that was pretty cool. So that's pretty much it guys. Um, again, right, this is a $1,500 a month channel um, in the, in the in the works right probably going to make an update video in the future and i'm pretty sure the channel will do pretty good um hopefully i will keep this um for the future right i will talk about this again how this plan went and watching things maybe we changed or how the channel is performing so stay tuned for that go ahead subscribe and ultimately again if you're interested in working with us growing your youtube automation channel go ahead schedule a call link in description um again it's not free, right? It is a high ticket program. And if you have capital to invest into YouTube and hiring a team and making videos, go ahead, schedule a call. I'll be happy to work with you. Thanks for watching guys. Have a good one. Bye.